Twenty million dollars to completely transform both Gore and Whiteface Mountains. That's what Governor Andrew Cuomo proposed during his trip to Plattsburgh Monday morning. We have to have first rate ski resorts. The governor delivering a speech very similar to a state of the state to a packed house at the Plattsburgh International Airport. He says the North Country is a priority, and that's why he's asking legislators to approve the $20 million, all to renovate the state's top ski resorts. We should be competing with Vail, Switzerland, Vancouver. At Whiteface, he wants to add a $3.5 million zip line. And $5 million to build the longest mountain coaster in the United States. The Olympic Regional Development Authority released a statement about the governor's proposal, saying, in part, the investment will build on the current facilities at the mountains and create an unparalleled tourism destination for visitors in the North Country. That's not all. The governor wants to reopen Frontier Town off of Interstate 87 and make it a gateway to the Adirondacks. He also mentioned the importance of investing in the state's airports, highlighting the recent $38 million grant to transform the Plattsburgh International Airport. Regional leaders say Cuomo's visit is good news for the region. I've been feeling good since the announcement about a week and a half ago, but this is fantastic to meet him, talk to him. I am just very excited about uh, his attendance today and looking forward to what's next for us. Next is getting approval from the state Senate and Assembly. But the people here aren't waiting to celebrate. Even talking about this kind of money coming to the region gets a standing ovation.